Arundel has many different and interesting electives you can take. As you prepare to pick classes for next year, keep these cool ones in mind. What up? Hi guys, my name is Maddie. I'm Imani. And we're going to be talking to you about the electives that are within the English department to add on your schedule for the next semester. Hey boys, this is a class where we're going to talk about books, and about dystopian worlds, and you watch movie clips, you read books, analyze them, and just... You have food Fridays. It's a lot of fun. Another English elective is creative writing and lit mag, but they're just about the same thing. You analyze and write poetry. You can create your own plays. You read and write a lot. Also have a journalism class where you can write, uh, also write skits, write poetry, write articles. All this can be uploaded on the Pulse and all videos and criteria will be viewed on Wildcat TV. Your book is about responsibility. Teamwork. What happens beyond the picture? <laughs> what else? It makes you look better for college admissions. And it helps you practice real world skills. It's not an easy A. It's not about getting your friends in the yearbook. It's about the dedication. And don't forget hard work. To produce something great. So what are you waiting for? Right. So sign up and take your book. There's just a lot of culture within Spanish, and there's a ton of countries that speak Spanish. Like Spain, Mexico, Puerto Rico. Bonjour! French is very fun. She's taken when you get here. French is a cool language to learn. You can play games like Congo Pass. take Chinese because we dance in class. We have lots of parties. And we go on great field trips. Yes. Oh, <laughs> you should really take German because it's a good class. It's a lot of fun. You should definitely take it. Hey gang, this is Miss Towns here. I teach an elective called Human Sexuality. It is an 18 week class that you can use for your elective credits. Just wanted to let you know that we cover a variety of topics in this class. I think they're very important for you. Uh, if you would get an opportunity in your schedule, I would love for you to sign up for Human Sexuality. Uh, I think we can answer a lot of your questions and I look forward to you signing up for the class. Thanks. Hi, I'm Miss Madden. I teach gymnastics and strength and conditioning for females. In both classes, we have an awesome time. Gymnastics, we get to do all of these things that you see behind me. We get to do beam and bars and get stronger and work on our flexibility. It's an awesome time. Strength and conditioning for females, we lift, we work on our technique, we work on our flexibility, and we get stronger and we get faster. It's great, take them. Uh, I'm Coach Walsh, uh, I teach strength and conditioning. I think you should definitely take my class. It's a great way to get stronger and meet new people and you need a phys ed credit anyway, so you might as well take my class. Hi, I'm Ms. Shuck and I teach um, some classes that are electives in the physical education department. Uh, walking wellness is one of my favorite courses I teach. We spend a lot of time outside in the woods, so if you enjoy getting out in the nature and you want to walk, please take walking wellness. I also teach a course called Lifetime Sports where we play games such as uh, beanbag toss and ping pong and volleyball, uh, sports that you would play in as you grow and become an adult in your lifetime. I also teach drug education. It's a class that will teach you about the many different drugs and the new and upcoming drugs to give you uh, the knowledge and education to make good choices in your future and, and why you want to say no to drugs. Hey, do you hey. dance? No. Do you know what you do in dance? No. Okay, you learn tap, jazz, ballet, and other kinds of dances that will make you into a better dancer. That's nice. What about dance for athletes? You're conditioned to be a better athlete as well as having to dance at the dance concert. 
Um, I'll check it out. Okay, bye. Bye. Here at Arundel, there is a lot of art and music electives that you can take for next year. For the musical electives, you can go for band, music tech, orchestra, jazz band, guitar, choir, vocal ensemble, chamber choir, piano, theater, and if you want to challenge, you can have AP Music Theory. If you're more of an art person, you can take Foundations of Art, 3D Studio, 2D Studio, also Photo Digital, AP Drawing, and Art History. Hey Amanda, how are you? Hey, I'm doing good. Just a little stressed out. Why? I have room on my schedule for one more class, but my parents don't want me taking another gym class since I already have two. Have you heard about the social study you're about to do? I think it's cool. No, actually I haven't. Can you give me an example? Yeah, I'm taking criminal justice and uh, sociology next semester, and in criminal justice you learn about the system, you know, when it's like catching criminals and like locking them up, and in sociology you learn about the relationships and cultures around the world. That sounds cool. But I'm more interested in things like presidents and congress. We have classes for them too. Really? Yeah. They have AP in comparative government and constitutional law. In comparative gov, you look at the different types of politics in different countries. And in constitutional law, you learn about interpreting and implementing the constitution. Oh wow, that sounds really cool. I'll look into them. You should. Oh yeah, and it, if those don't interest you, you should look into yeah. like, African American history because you know they just teach you about African American history in America. That sounds really fun. That I'll look into it. Thanks for the help. No problem. Catch you later. Bye. 